lot of people been asking me, Tro, what's going on with the Kronos meme coins, man? What is going on? What's happening? What's in the ecosystem? How do you feel about the Kronos meme coins? And today, man, I'm making a very important video about the Kronos meme coins. I love what Kronos is doing, but it's a couple of things that I see that needs work or that you know people can or the ecosystem can you know come together on and really just you know enhance the entire ecosystem for the better and it's a lot of things also that a lot of these um decentralized entities or so-called decentralized entities can do better uh, with the chronos blockchain but overall i do believe in the chronos mean coins and today we're going to get in the nitty and gritty of things man we're going to talk about a multitude of chronos meme coins and how i feel about them uh, where i believe the space is going and much much more but before we get into that make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn on those notifications for all things chronos ecosystem so enough of that let's talk about it man chronos has been doing some amazing things these past couple of months um they finally started embracing meme coins now we saw the first meme coin on chronos corgi ai it came out around you know last year around this same time and it took months for it to take off but it eventually went past you know their 500 million dollar market cap um it like i said it came out in about july 2023 um it took off about november or december of uh 2023 and it just went on the absolute rampage and i don't think anybody saw it coming a couple of people might have saw it coming um but i don't think nobody really just paid attention to corgi until it was too late and that's what made everybody really start getting into all of these different meme coins on the chronos ecosystem but i kept saying i was like man in order for chronos to bring volume they have to make their own projects now we did you know it first had a lot of chronos projects when the chronos blockchain came out we saw things like uh mad meerkat finance or mmf um we saw of course bbs finance which is sponsored by uh chronos or crypto.com or chronos blockchain whatever you want to call it um we seen vino finance we seen tectonic but all of these things were not innovative all of these things were pretty much copy and paste of different projects on other blockchains and i always said something has to come to chronos that absolutely just stands apart and gives chronos a name for itself because these copy and paste projects aren't aren't different from any other you know decentralized exchange or decentralized lending protocol or you know liquid staking protocols it's nothing different from them they just got a different name we also started to see like i said other projects sneak up such as corgi came out and did what they needed to do now and previous you know when fast forwarded when we start to see meme coins take off again on solana on avax on all these other blockchains i'm pretty sure if you go to you know deck screen and go to another blockchain you will see nine times out of ten the number one crypto project in volume is a meme coin i think chrono started to realize that and say hey let's embrace these meme coins man let's embrace people building meme coins on the blockchain but then i think they took it overboard so what i mean by that um instead of really truly embracing the meme coins that's you know community ran meme coins i believe you know uh chronos did it kind of different and did it in a weird way and what i mean by that um they started to really you know put all these imos or you know um these uh igos or whatever you want to call it uh initial gem offerings um pretty much trying to put the meme coins that they believe that we will like or they i don't know if they think we will like it or they just want to suck liquidity out of the ecosystem it's kind of hard to tell because they continue to drop them and you know the first couple of meme coins did good um i think by the dip um is pretty much a, a that's one of the good meme coins that came from the um initial gem offering or whatever you want to call it um but all these other ones we see it's so much liquidity in these meme coins that we know is backed by chronos or the vvs team or somebody in the higher ups on the crypto.com team um but they just really haven't been moving and it you know something is going on when you see more liquidity than you see um or about the same liquidity you see uh with the 
the actual market cap of the coin so we got to pay attention to those things man because we don't know what chronos intentions are like i love the community ran projects i love you know mary crow with knife i love push i love all these og communities and instead of supporting these communities i feel like chronos uh the team is really trying to push their own agenda or push their own meme coins on us instead of getting in giving incentives now vvs does the do the meme coin mania um as far as with uh, some of the community ran projects they get a vote and you know whichever community um really wins that vote then they you know create a liquidity pool for them but i think they should do incentives for all of the chronos meme coins in my personal opinion now let's take a look at this man let's take a look is it too late for chronos meme coins let's let's talk about it now currently i am on deck screen and we looking at chronos meme coins we can see mary is number one i love to see that because mary is a community driven project um we see emmett uh, i'm not too sure about emmett i think that's a community ran project as well um but you can see um just looking at it a lot of these things are in the red mary is down seven percent call is up five percent uh emmy that's a new project it's up 87 percent. we got to understand those new projects are going to be up but i would i always advise people hey don't be the extra liquidity if you didn't find that project day one uh, before it took off like crazy um try to you know pace yourself because every project drops at least 50 percent after it goes up like crazy now push the push is one of my favorite ones because um, we look at push and i'm not trying to shield anybody push although i am invested in it. i gotta let you know that um it's about nine thousand holders and we've seen yesterday was a green day i was buying you know at one point uh really right at a million dollar market cap so we looking really good man we looking push is looking good um like i said this is a community ran project everything checks out uh, i love to see how they continue to build it's only going to get bigger um and what i mean with the other projects such as loaf i believe loaf was one of those projects that um debuted it on you know the vvs finance and uh, the chronos blockchain i think these was one of the uh, initial gem offerings um, but as you can see this was the latest one and it's seven million dollars in liquidity but only a 7.4 market cap that's off to me and all of these days have been red guys so you gotta understand man these projects i believe the community are spotting it out um they're finally seeing okay uh chronos really doesn't have our best interest at heart and if they do it's like they're not really showing it because i will be using this money to give back to the community of these og projects this project right now says it only has one holder now this might be off because this is a new project but it's not looking too good for um loaf to me in my personal opinion i would not buy loaf um at these prices now i'm not saying they didn't want to appreciate just saying that i i want to you know show love to all the real og you know community members in the chronos ecosystem rather than you know something that's kind of put upon us now we see mouse and pasta i made a video about this as well it's been dropping too it's been you know but this is a, a community ran project i believe it's only about 3.5k holders um so not a lot of holders but at a two million dollar market cap i do believe this could possibly be a good buy i'm not telling anybody to uh, buy it or anything i know they got listed um on the centralized exchange recently so they're doing some big things in my personal opinion the moon was another one guys we can see look at this man 8.7 million dollars in liquidity but only 12 million dollars in a market cap that doesn't add up to me that tells me that this is a chronos driven type of project not a community ran project and like i said all these projects that don't have a community guys they eventually tank because you can't just put something on us anymore i believe chronos really bamboozled a lot of people already <laughs> not and i still and i still interact with the chronos blockchain um but just since the beginning guys we've seen you know chronos really embrace the chronos projects that they built but not the chronos projects that community members built and i remember back in the day when mml first came out that's for the real og chronos users um chronos really kind of didn't push mf until it was too late and mml finance kind of they fumbled the bag all the way they could have been you know still one of the top um decentralized exchanges but they tried to go every you know try to go on every blockchain and then the way they went about going on every blockchain was insane they created new tokens and 
you know, I just think if they had a little more, you know, structure and a little more um, thought process behind it, they still would be one of the top decentralized exchanges. And I do believe they could have, you know, had all the meme coins on there because they were bringing all different types of protocols on MMF while VVS was kind of just sticking to, you know, some of the top uh, names in the crypto space and not, you know, a uh, VV or Kronos inspired type of projects. MMF was embracing it, but they kind of dropped the bag. But we can see uh, just Kronos, especially with all of these different um, projects that came out around that time, they have been known for pretty much kind of trying to milk the community. I won't say necessarily just purposely take away from the community but even the way vvs finance dropped man we know it was you know some big investors behind it um and they took liquidity as soon as retail got in as soon as the market started turning liquidity was taken although it's still about a hundred million dollars left on vvs finance the token dropped like crazy and i think they timed it very perfectly and that's what made me get kind of skeptical of anything that chronos drops and like i said corgi ai really came out at a good time i do believe corgi ai is a you know chronos inspired type of project but it dropped when it was no other meme coin on the blockchain so it was the one and only so it was it was set for it to take off at that time but now with these imos on vvs finance i will stay clear of them um you can do your own research on them but like i said like this project the moon um is really tanking it's almost back at entry now you might can get at a good price at entry i would say um wait for the entry price on the moon if you want to invest in it. me personally i'm staying away from those things because um like i said it's only 2.7k holders um eight million dollars in liquidity is crazy for a project that only has 2.7k holders um compared to all these other projects that has about ten thousand. a lot of things going on with the chronos ecosystem um and i'm still super bullish on chronos i love what chronos is doing um i still invest in crow i still invest in a lot of meme coins on the chronos blockchain but i do stay away from those meme coins um that really were put out by vvs or put out by the chronos team because it's not the community guys and you know me i always say in meme coins the most important thing you gotta look for is the community if the community isn't backing it if the community isn't talking about it stay away from it because when those prices drop 50 percent those are the people who's gonna hold up the last leg who's gonna stand the test of time who's gonna stand their ground with the community or with the ones that's that doesn't have a community those are the ones that you know go all the way back into entry prices and no one ever talks about again now like i said it's different for by the dip i think by the dip has a community i think they did good with their launching but all these other ones i'm very skeptical of um not saying they won't appreciate but i would personally stay away from them at this time so chronos meme coins are gonna have its day um i do believe it's still super early in this bull market i don't think it's over you know i think you know we have still about a couple of months i think we only about 37 percent into this bull market in my personal opinion uh, we almost at 50 but we not quite halfway there um i do believe 2020 uh the end of 2024 and the beginning of 2025 will be very great for the crypto space and we will see chronos meme coins absolutely appreciate especially the ones that have or are community driven so crypto troll that's my video for today if i added value make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn on those notifications and share this content with anybody you know who is invested in the chronos ecosystem and also leave a super thanks to support the channel and help the channel to continue to grow man crypto troll i'm out of here